Hi, this is Dan from Marginally Clever, and today we're putting together a Michelangelo drawing robot. The, what, the piece we're doing today is um, a corner motor mount. This piece uh, mounts onto the edge of a board, something like this, or it can mount with suction cups, like this, onto a whiteboard. So, first of all, let's check our inventory. We should have two boards, like this. We should have three suction cups, an Allen key, two set screws, a spacer, eight M3 by 35 screws, a pulley, eight nuts, and there we go, <laughs> and, uh, and it's a temper motor. So to start with, we'll do one corner, uh, one screw in one corner. I put this screw in this corner hole. And then I put a washer on here, uh, the spacer, sorry. Then I put a nut. Oh. Be quiet, manager. I'm leaving this a little bit loose because I have to tighten it onto this. Good. Now I do the others. One screw. Oh, there, I've got that in. Tighten it from the back. And then all the way back. And if you want to give it an extra quarter turn or so, that's not going anywhere. That'll stay right where we want it. Each of these holes needs one more screw, same as we've done here. All right, that's good and stiff. Now, There are two holes on the pulley. If you drive the set screw all the way through, you'll see it in the hole. You should be able to see it there now. What you you want to back off just enough so that it's not sticking through the hole. You'll also see there's a flat side on the shaft. One of these one of these set screws is going to come through and touch on that flat side so that it stays really tight. I may have done that out of sequence. I should have done the second set screw first, but whatever. Now, the, set, the pulley goes on the flat and notice how the, the edge here Edge that I'm pointing to with the with the Allen key, the bottom edge. You want it as close to the the wood as possible, and then tighten, tighten, tighten. There we go. Now I turn this to find the other one. All right, now that's not going anywhere. That's staying exactly where we want. Now we have two variations. We're mounting onto a whiteboard. Twist to insert. Notice how I leave the tabs on the outside. If they're under the wood, I can't pull them up. And then I would have a hard time removing it from a window. For mounting it on a board, you take an extra four screws, and our extra four nuts. I only put these on a very short distance. And the reason is so that I have the Mac, I don't have to loosen them again when I go to clamp it onto a board. Now this 
This will form a clamp on the corner of a piece of wood. More on that later. Okay. So, repeat the other side and you should have two that look like this. These clips will go into the electronic controller. Our belts will come up from here, over the pulleys, and down to the center. 